Here's number two. It takes 125 minutes for A to decrease in concentration from 0 0.750 molar to 0 0.350 molar at 20 degrees C in a first order reaction. Now remember, uh, first order decomposition involves like a logarithmic plot, okay? So you can't just do simple ratios. Um, it takes 125 minutes to decrease in concentration from 0.75 molar to 0.350 molar, okay? How long will it take for the reaction to be 85% per complete? All right, so first of all, what we want to do is use the uh, first order um, integrated rate law to figure out what the rate constant is and then um, use that rate constant to solve the question. The integrated rate law for a first order reaction looks like this. The natural log of the initial time, initial amount, minus the natural log of the t amount at time t is equal to k times uh, t. Okay, And we are trying to find what k is. So k if we divide both of uh, sides of this equation by time, k is equal to the natural log of um, the amount or concentration of A minus A times T divided by T. Okay, and we want to plug in these values here. So the initial concentration according to our um, graph or word problem is 0 0.750 molar and after time t the concentration went down divide all that guy by 125 minutes and what we will get here is um, a value of 6.097 times 10 to the minus 3 reciprocal minutes. And now we'll use this K to solve the question, how long will it take for the reaction to be 85% complete? All right, so the reaction starts out at 100% and then it eventually ends up at 85% complete. Um, that means that the amount remaining, right, unreacted, is going to be 15%. Okay? We have 100% remaining in the beginning and 15% remaining at the end, and we want to know how long it takes. So, again, we use the integrated rate equation for this. So, the natural log of A at time t minus log of A at, oops, that should be a zero, is equal to KT, okay? And so we want to find time, so divide both sides of this equation by um, the rate constant. And that's going to be equal to uh, time, okay? And we plug in our values, okay? So the time here is going to be the uh, natural log of the concentration initially, which is 100%. And then we um, are going to have 15% you know, remaining. And we divide that by the K that we figured out, 6.097 times 10 to the minus 3 reciprocal minutes. And let's go ahead and punch this all into our uh, calculator here. And I get a value of 311 uh, minutes.